Alright guys, today we are going to be doing an older Lush kitchen item. Uh, this one is called Chalky Egg and I did purchase this last year. It would have been around April of last year um, in the kitchen. So you guys have to let me know down below how you are dealing without having the Lush kitchen. Um, I'm I'm missing it right about now. I really do miss like getting my hands on some of these older products. And I've never actually used this one before. Never done a demo. Never had one. Um, so it's about time since Easter is upon us. Uh, but like I said, this one is called Chalky Egg, and it does have these little shavings of chocolate here on it, and they are also on the other side as well. And the scent description on this is vanilla and, well, obviously chocolate. And I really do like the smell of this. I smell the vanilla scent more than I smell chocolate, at least right now. We'll see after uh, I do put it in the water. But it's just a very nice, soft vanilla smell. Um, I think it smells wonderful. So I, I don't really know how our bath butter is going to be with that brown color of the chocolate, but we shall see when we stick it in. So let's go ahead and see what it looks like. guys, so our Chalky Egg bath bomb is all fizzed out. This one pretty well did exactly what I would expect from the bath bomb. It kind of reminded me a bit of the uh, Butterball bath bomb, um, except of the Cocoa Butter bits. We actually have like actual Cocoa bits and they are definitely laying around down there on the bottom of the water. Hopefully that melts a little bit. Um, but I will say I prefer prefer the clear water over like brown water, if you know what I mean. Uh, the scent though, I do like the smell. Um, I do smell the chocolate a bit, but I think I feel like I smell the vanilla way more. And I do like the smell. It's just a very nice soft vanilla scent in my opinion. Um, so I'm going to fill up my toes the rest of the way and hop on in here and I'll be back with what I thought afterwards. with my chalky egg bath bomb. As you can see, not all of the chocolate pieces melted, so I do have some to clean up on the bottom. And it's definitely not the most attractive thing in the world. It's like, you know, poop smears on the bottom of the tub is what it looks like. It's just definitely not attractive. It wasn't a very attractive bath or anything like that. Now, I did like the scent of it. Um, it wasn't a very strong smell though, just very light. So overall, like I'm not surprised that this bath bomb hasn't made its way out for like Easter again or anything like that, just because it's not, it's not really the most amazing thing ever. But I did like the smell of it. 
Um, and really, if I were to use one again, which I do have another one, um, I would probably put it in a cocktail of some sort just so it can mix with some, you know, a nice watercolor or something like that. Just give it a little oomph to it. Uh, but overall, I mean, it was okay. It really does make me miss the, the kitchen, though, and just, you know, being able to try out some older Lush products that I never have before. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. You'll have to let me know down below. If you're not already subscribed, just hit that button, and I will see you next time.